Day seven, seven days in, proud of myself. It's eight, almost nine o'clock. Gonna go make this tea, get this tea in. Uh, I'm gonna try to get two walks in. I'm gonna do it, no, I'm gonna do it. So I'm gonna do a morning one, I'm gonna do an evening one, just to make up for the fifth day that I missed. Uh, but yeah, just to hold true to it. Uh, man, it's day seven, I'm gonna get weighed in. See how I did as far as that. Uh, but it's the last day. Let's see what tea we got today. In the morning, I think it's it's burdock. Last burdock root. And this evening, it's dandelion. Right? Turmeric ginger. So, yeah, man. Good morning, good morning, good morning. 8.57 a.m. Uh, getting this tea going. Let's turn up, man. Seven days. I did it. You can do it. I'm talking to myself. Yeah, so I'm out here, man. I got my folks over there. Smell like they burning wood. But uh, headed for the first walk of the day. Cause I gotta do one later on too. Just to make sure I get seven in. Already I'm probably like 12, 13 miles on a week. So yeah, man, it's day seven, coming to an end, at least for this week. So we'll we'll find something else to do, a challenge or something, but yeah, hope you Finishing up walk number one, you know what I'm saying? We tired. We tired, she I'm tired. tired. I'm tired. This walk number one though, so she, she a little, she ain't been I'm out here with me. Shape. But uh, I ain't nothing but like a good 1.5, I think. So, yeah, man. We got one more nighttime walking. It's in the book, man. We wrapping it up, man. Let's get Hefe, healthier Hefe vlogs. All right. I'm done. Um, hey, y'all. I did my second walk. I got my feet up. I'm tired. I'm day seven in the books. I'm gonna drink my tea. It's 7 Eleven. I'm calling it a night. Uh, I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna put the summary in on this vlog. How about that? I'm gonna do a recap in the morning and put the summary about the whole experience. Um, so, yeah. Stay tuned. All right, let's get into it, man. It's currently 5.04 on Sunday, uh, November 24th. <clears throat> Hopefully y'all be able to see that. Um, let's get into it, man. Simple recap of everything that went on. Um, of, of the, the seven days of the Healthier Hefe vlog. Um, and just to recap, things I did was uh, not eat after 7, not eat before 11 a.m. So not eat after 7 p.m., not eat before 11 a.m. But the main focus was getting my two teas in a day, which between uh, burdock root and mullein for the morning teas and turmeric ginger and dandelion root leaf, leaf and root for, um, for the evening teas. And also to walk one to three miles daily. Um, Overall, how do I feel? I feel currently it's five o'clock. I'm up, I'm not sluggish. I went to bed about 11, woke back up at four. I can tell that my energy levels did boost. Um, I did after like fasted cardio of those days, some of those days, like I did feel um, a little groggy uh, after eating, but you know, I could do. I could have done better with eating. Um, now, I did weigh myself in the beginning and weigh myself at the end, and I should put on like two pounds. But we can't look at weight loss and just 
uh, say, oh, well, that doesn't matter. Uh, the thing is weight loss. You gotta have proper rest. Um, you gotta have uh, better dieting in my in this situation, cause a couple times on this in this um, seven day span, I did find myself cutting it close to that seven o'clock mark. Um, so if I was to say any improvement as far as food, proper plan ahead, and a couple days I was supposed to make a menu and procrastination. Uh, I talked about it, distraction um, breeds procrastination. So going forward uh proper scheduling that's the thing schedule properly and i'm talking to myself uh because i don't want to be preachy to you all but proper scheduling would have set me up better now uh the teas weren't difficult to get down didn't use any sweeteners um how else did i feel um after the walks i could say i mean look at the, with the makeup walk, let me see how much did I walk actually. Um, one second, one second, one second. So, in seven days, I'm gonna show you guys so y'all can know. Uh, you can see it says seven workouts, and I walked a total of 13.53 miles, so almost 14 miles, which would equate to, um, two miles a day so I did dedicate uh, that time and it was it was um, it was uplifting to say the least um, some of those was night walks and I needed it just for reflection debunking um, like I said the whole reason behind these things is to be a better Joshua. Behind these healthy FA vlogs is to be a better Joshua. And to, you know, challenge myself to go further because I am going further in life. So I really wanted to um, hone in on that. Now, um, the consistency thing, uh, I can say this, this quick little journey of stint um it's about consistency um even when you don't want to do it you have to do it like um i didn't want to make up that that walk that i missed on day five but i had to um and i could say oh it's because i'm holding myself accountable for the camera no something inside me is like hold yourself accountable for you um the teas it got late uh, in the day and i was like Let, let's be honest so Day seven, I'm like, at nighttime, I didn't want to drink that tea last night, but I knew I needed to. I knew I had to finish the job. So um, consistency is a big thing in my life that I have to work on. Huh? Um, so this was, this was, this was a good, a good bet, you know, one after it. Um, I can say clarity of mind was something that I can tell improved. I felt better. I I just thought better, thought better thoughts, and it's less negative, you know. Certain things happen, and you just let it roll off of you. Uh, I can't say those teas like burdock root. It, it did the teas did help like move bowel. So if that's a problem you're having, uh, turmeric is great for inflammation. Ginger is great for the stomach, the gut. Um, burdock root cleansing the blood, dandelion root cleansing the kidney so I felt like those things this week was the tea thing really helped and um yeah I can ramble on and ramble on but overall I rate this experience I say a 7 out of 10 cause I can get better so um we did go to Vibes Urban Market and we got some sea moss gel Sour syrup gummies, sea moss gel, and so maybe that's the next thing that healthier Hefe vlogs about is uh, you know making shakes with sea moss. Haven't had it. Uh, my wife had it before, but I hadn't. But um, we're gonna keep going up, and we're gonna keep this series going. Um, probably won't be as daily unless I choose to do like another week of you know this and that. But we're gonna keep this series going. I thank y'all for tuning in. If you did tune in, if you didn't, hopefully you learned some. 
if I was able to give you something to learn about. If not, I still love you and appreciate you. Uh, yeah, so make sure y'all visit my website, uh, www.thehuskylabofficial.com. Make sure you like and subscribe to this uh, channel, share this content. Um, I'm grateful for life. Always be grateful for life because uh, somebody didn't get it. Somebody didn't wake up at 4 something this morning and was able to see their family resting and breathing. So thank y'all for, thank you. At this point, thank you, Joshua, for challenging Joshua. Thank you, Husky Hefe, the fat fitness model, Jose Cortez for challenging Husky Hefe, the fat fitness model, Jose Cortez to be the best. Um, Oh, and before I go, look, I didn't do a lot on day seven. Uh, nothing too fascinating. I did watch this cool movie on Netflix or a documentary by now. Um, yeah, people, I say wake up, but uh, uh, um, yeah, thank y'all. I'm out. Um, send me some, send me some um, information or content that you'd like to see me see or uh, see me do or challenge. You know. But thank y'all. Peace, love, chicken grease, five o'clock. I'm about to edit this. Probably go back to sleep for a little bit, but uh, baby girl, baby girl. Peace.